The UK's train providers are used to facing scrutiny on a daily basis, and according to a recent survey by consumer group Which, rail passengers in the southeast of England are the least satisfied in the UK. So we took to Waterloo Station to gain the general impressions of London's rail users and to find out if they really are as disgruntled as some might think. My general impression is the trains are reasonably good, although sometimes you do get a fair amount of disruption. Um, so everyone's done. There's also like the attitude of people when they tell you that the train's delayed. That's probably what I, I pick out most as my issue. I mean, I personally don't feel like they're as bad as everyone makes out, but I don't have to use them every day, so maybe I'd be more sick of them if I had to use them every day. But I don't know. At rush hour. I don't understand why they can't get extra carriages. I was shocked when I went to buy a return ticket to here from Kingston with a £10 note thinking I'd get change and I had to delve on and on for the extra £2.10. Quite shocked. With an overall satisfaction score of just 46%, South Eastern was the joint worst performing operator alongside Thameslink and Great Northern. We asked commuters what could be done to improve the service. I don't understand why they can't either put Maybe make the, car, the tra actual trains shorter in the daytime and put extra carriages on in the evening. The customer service, I just think that's something you can get right. It doesn't matter if your trains are late or something. If you get your customer service right, then people's impression and the experience will be better.